symmetric tensor. A covariant tensor A i j of rank 2 is called symmetric tensor if A lower suffix i j is equal to A lower suffix j i. Similarly, a contravariant tensor A i j of rank 2 is called symmetric if A upper suffix i j is equal to A upper suffix j i. For a general tensor, the symmetry is defined for a pair of similarly indices. A symmetric tensor covariant or contravariant of rank 2 has at most half n into n plus 1 different components in n dimensional space Vn. Let us consider Aij be the components of a symmetric covariant tensor of rank 2. The total number of components of Aij is n square. Then all components of Aij are A11, A12, A13, A14 up to A1n, A21, A22, A23, A24 up to A2n, A31, A32, A33, A34 up to A3n and in the last row we will get An1, An2, An3, An4 up to Ann. The number of components of the form A11, A22, A33 up to Ann is n. The number of non-diagonal components Aij where i is not equal to j is n square minus n. But the components of Aij are symmetric. Therefore, the number of independent components of the form Aij where i is not equal to j reduced to half of n square minus n. Therefore, the total number of independent components equal to half of n square minus n plus n. After simplification, we will get half of n into n plus 1. For example, let us consider three dimensional components of Aij that is A11, A12, A13, A21, A22, A23, A31, A32, A33. Here total number of components is 3 square that is 9. Number of components of the form A11, A22, A33 is equal to 3. Number of non-diagonal components is 3 square minus 3 that is 9 minus 3 that is equal to 6 because the total number of components is 9 and number of diagonal elements is 3. Independent non-diagonal components will be reduced to half since A21 is equal to A12, A31 is equal to A13 and A32 is equal to A23. Therefore, independent non-diagonal components is 6 by 2 that is equal to 3. Therefore, the total number of independent components is 3 plus 3 equal to 6 that is half of 3 into 3 plus 1.